sweet taste of Marlboro Golds, the choice cigarette of Seth Syntax Streams, sweet taste of Marlboro <laughs> Sith's Supremely Saucy Video Stream, July Highlights, Part 2. Fuck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, honestly, I wanted to start a little bit earlier anyway, because, uh, you know, te technically, the time proceeds faster in the European time zone. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh, yeah. We don't have to fucking maintain our numbers, by the way, in terms of how many people are viewing. I think I only had, like, some kind of stipulation uh to do it once like if we hit 5k like it was it was considered good so we don't fucking we don't need any of this shit anymore okay so what do i got for you people i got uh i got games that are fucking crashing on me give me a sec all right can i just tell you what i did like last night so last night i think i was up until 3 a.m i was up till 3 a.m. because I wanted to get some old ass games working. <laughs> and uh, I, I failed to do that because I was trying to use um, VMs. I was trying to do virtual box and shit like that. Uh, anyhow. <laughs> What's good? I wonder if I can actually scale this. Yeah. Can this be heard? I hope this can be heard. I so I try to set up a bunch of virtual boxes. I, I can show you how like my Windows ninety eight looks right right now. Uh, <laughs> it does not look very good whatsoever. The f fuck is yeah my my Windows ninety eight is like completely fucked. I think like I completely screwed up the uh, installation. <laughs> uh, you want background music? Sure. <laughs> this is the sound of money pouring in. I so my Windows 98 is completely fucked for the installation because it's just stuck on um, plug and play devices, so it's never gonna be finished ever. Yeah, so that's not interesting to see. Oh man, I hope Seth has a high quality stream. But now, so at the end of the day, the game that I wanted to work in a virtual machine does not work in a virtual machine because it can't use the virtual driver. But what does work on virtual machine is fucking 3D pinball. I, oh, that's good shit. Oh, I wonder if uh, that would work. Give me a sec. Oh, that's that's nuts. Okay. Yeah, let me scale that shit. Fit to my screen. Yeah, boy. This game doesn't actually scale, does it? Give me a sec. I'm gonna let have a Nagula play through. But uh, I'm, I'm really happy that at least one thing is working on this fucking virtual machine. You get easy ass points if you do the manual redeploy. <laughs> See how fucking shit I am after not playing this for enough years? This is what happens. I don't know how many people actually played the XP pinball, but this was the shit. I am, uh, I'm doing a fantastic job of fucking everything up. I even practiced this last night to try and make sure I don't fucking embarrass myself. <laughs> Come on.
Come on, give me my goddamn hyperspace. Oh, I actually have a mission. Sorry. I, if you hear something in the background, that's my, uh, that's my refrigerator going crazy because it's broke. Oh, fuck. <laughs> a vanilla transmit. I've actually already scuffed this game. I swear to god, I need to hit at least one hyperspace before I stop. Good Necro. Anyway, give me a sec. My fridge is going fucking crazy. Okay, wait, wait, wait. How do I rescale this? Please, uh, please reset that. Give me that display. Yeah. Oh yeah, I technically have to save a name drop. Uh, hey, hey, people, this makes it a real stream. Uh, yeah. So, my, my virtual machine adventures have been absolutely fucked. I do have Minesweeper and stuff like that. That's absolutely fine. Um, however, we got better things to do. I, I managed to actually get shit running. Because I wanted to play some old ass shit last time we played. But I found out uh, you could get something called DG Voodoo. This is like a little wrapper for uh, old ass games. And that makes it r run really, really well. Let's see. Let's see if... Uh... Hey, it actually opens up. What's good? Oh, this is beautiful. Wait. Yeah. What's good? Oh, yeah. This is the shit I wanted to work, because my mom was asking about it. <laughs> this is the best fucking game. Wait, let, let's see if I can actually scale this up for my sake. This is, this is a game which is uh, very endearing to me. And this man is very emotive. He actually makes little different facial expressions wherever you're looking at. It's like, um... When it's 3 p.m. dick flattening time, and she hasn't arrived yet to flatten your dick. <laughs> and of course, if you, um, whatever you click, he just picks up a card and shit like that. And if you actually close the game, he does this. Okay, crash the game. Give me a sec. Oh, okay. It auto-detects the window. That's pretty good. I. So... I'm gonna try to make the sound a little bit lower. Give me a sec. I'm gonna put this down to 10. Yeah. <laughs> if you wanna if you wanna ask my mom, we're 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 Jewish fruit and fruit, so uh, you don't become a human being until you got your PhD. That's why unfortunately I'm still not a humanoid, because I only got a I only got a master's. I don't even have my uh, my doctorate. Anyhow. Let me tell you about this game. This is a, a fantasy world, which is filled with strife and pain. There's three different races in this game. And those different races are the Pimons, which get smashed off fucking mushroom juice that they fermented. Um, this is the... Wait, what are they called actually again? Ah, the Sajikis. But I think they have a different name, sorry. I, I actually forgot right now. Basically, they're bug people. They want to kill everybody, but they're really dumb, so they can't do that. And uh, this is a hellish society of Amazons, where women are the people who are in control, and the gender roles have been replaced all over. So yeah, let me show you some shit. 
Yo, what's good? Yeah, this is uh, this is the start of the game. Okay, how do I pause? Yeah. Okay. In uh, wait, let me let me check if I could actually put the sound down for you boys. Yeah, a little bit lighter. In in Amazon society, by the way, this is what this is what your average delivery woman looks like in uh, in Amazon society. It, it, it's dark, by the way, because this is a. Uh, it has like different time periods, so this is the morning. I. So women occupy every uh, good profession in life. Women are builders, construction workers, everything. And you know what men do? Men are the fucking hunter gap are the fucking berry pickers who just do nothing but sit at home and look hot th 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 this is what you're going to be relegated to if you're a man in amazonian society life is hell and in that hell all you can do is uh look hot and fornicate and i guess gather apples occasionally uh but wait i want to Wait, 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 wait. I want to show you... Wait, what the fuck? Yeah, truly a male power fantasy. Give me a sec. Okay. I want you to appreciate one thing. So, even if you play as the bug people, I want to show you a bug mommy. Also, the, also the, the goddamn Sajiki campaign, it, it is amazing. Okay, wait, where are the thick, the thick fucking bug titties? You see that shit? Like, like, I know they're bugs, but that is, that is some thick ass bugs. Look at those milkers. Wait, see if I could do a pause frame on that shit. Oh yeah, boy. Oh yeah, boy. Uh, anyhow, I want to... This game is actually kind of realistic. Let me put some priority on this. Uh, I'm very out of shape with playing this game, so sorry about that. <sighs> anyway, you go through all the tech phases in this game, and uh... What is rather realistic about this game is uh, to get research done, you gotta hire a researcher. But the amount of money that you have to pay a researcher depends on their exact degree. So, if we get somebody who's a bachelor, like this man here, we only gotta pay him like a small amount of money. If you get a master or a PhD, you're gonna be paying crazy fucking money. And much like re researchers in real life, the moment you're done with them, you fucking fire them. It's a nice little game. I actually recommend it if you uh, ever get the time. But... Fuck. I think actually also the Pimans, they've got pretty uh, thick, thick women as well. Let me check that shit. Wait. More of a fat titty Pimon women. Yeah. Look at that stuff. You have to be smashed off mushroom juice to be tapping that. Oh yeah, and you know what's great? Like you start with like kids and so on. Eventually they become teenagers and get edgy. And if you don't give them a job, much like real life, they uh, become uh, hooligans. They, they literally become criminals and commit arson. That is the life cycle. Okay, wait, 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 let's quit this. Why does the building sound sound like someone beating off? <laughs> I tried to run a Internet Explorer on like this really uh, fucked up copy of uh, Windows XP. And uh, you can actually access almost fucking nothing in this goddamn browser. We, we were just trying to experiment to, to get something normal going. <laughs> Wait, let's use the fucking antiquity 
Internet Explorer and look for Ben Shapiro. <laughs> I can't believe this stuff actually works so great. Uh, it, it has a problem, though. It, it actually just can't display almost every web page. Yeah, yeah. I think even if you use Chrome, everything is still fucked. Oh, the Russian game I played last stream, it's uh, 7.62 caliber. You can look it up. Yeah. Okay. Now, I wonder, I wonder if, uh, desktop stripper. <laughs> I know it won't work, so it won't actually, uh, oh no. Hot babes perform erotic exclusive shows on your desktop? Get eye stripper for free? McAfee secure? Hell yeah, boys. <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Let me uh let me put this to window capture so you can see us a little bit better. Fuck. Yeah, boy. Please scale to my... Yes, fantastic. Where is our desktop stripper? By the way, each time... <laughs> Don't worry, everything is sandboxed here. I'm sure nothing can happen. Launch eye stripper. Uh... Uh, yes. Your one step continue. Um, show me the, wait, wait, give me a throwaway email to retrieve, to recover your, wait, wait, wait. Oh no, they, they won't actually check whatever this is anyway. I think they'll just, yeah. <laughs> Loading. Oh my Lord. Quit tutorial. Quality low. <laughs> Hotness level. Nudity. I've never seen shit like this. Is, is this the gotcha of, of fucking desktop strippers? Hotness level. Quality low. Just like this stream. Okay. I guess that's uh, an angle that we can't actually go for. I stripper can't even beat the tutorial. So, uh, I do have something else that people have been asking about. And let me tell you about something else that uh, I've been introduced to. Uh, it's, uh, because somebody was talking about Girls Front Lion. I have something coincidentally related to that. I got this stuff privately uh, given to me. Codename Bakery Girl is the thing that came before Girls Front Line. There's my French hatred. Yeah, it's very loud. I am sorry. It actually resets the sound. It resets the fucking sound each time. Like, like, I actually found out that the sound of low. I'm very sorry. Oh, yeah, let's see where we are. So this game is essentially like old ass Advance Wars. It's, uh, it's pretty interesting. Um, but I, I don't actually have enough, uh, content to actually... <laughs> the fuck are these missions? Okay. All, all, all you have to know is it, it works a lot like Advanced Wars. It, it, it does seem to be a nice little game. And, uh, I had it generously translated from Japanese because, uh, when you go into the escape menu, you need to know what the fuck you're going to be clicking. Oh, wait. I think I have a... Oh, no. If I go back to the main menu, that's not good. It, it also, this game, this game fucking dumps lore on you like fucking crazy. Oh, yeah, I heard about Sky Williams. Sky, Sky, Sky Williams is suffering a Jeffrey Epstein right now. 
In his defense, he never knew that there were underage girls in his house. Okay, actually, 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 uh, Magobi, if you want French hatred, uh, I think the Outward de developers never actually spoke to me and, uh, never really formally, uh, had real, any real interaction with us, so that's my mix of French hatred. I only have French hatred for that company. But, uh, you know what this game does? This is actually, like, the second tutorial mission, but if you move over to this thing, Here's what fucking happens. <laughs> you get you get a fucking lore dump. <laughs> Do you know how big this lore dump is? This lore dump is is a good short essay. This is a good short Iron Rand Atlas Shrugged, so you can learn about the fucking backdrop of this game. <laughs> Anyhow. Oh. I will show that off when I actually know uh, more about the game and then I can actually properly play it without uh, making a fool of myself. Wait, 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 you want me to actually read that shit? <laughs> yeah, maybe sometime. Uh, oh yeah, I need to uh, uh, check for interest. So some people are asking if you'd be uh, interested in lectures. Now that sounds gay as fuck. Uh, but if you would like a cancer lecture, yeah, yeah, we can do that. Uh, I don't know exactly uh, which topics would be interesting, so uh, I could I could give a a generalized one. Probably with uh, some something that I know that's actually specific. But uh, yeah, if there's if there's questions, I can probably like check at the end of the stream, and then uh, I don't know. I can cover a, bu a bunch of the bases. Gay lectures on prostate cancer. Well, well, legit, actually, one of the best ways to avoid prostate cancer is, yeah, literally, coom. Um, I, I, it goes for a any single organ in your body. If you're uh, having an active use of it, the, the tissues are going to be a little bit more resilient to having transformed cells because, you know, you're going to have a background inflammation which is still useful enough to traffic in immune cells. So yeah, literally, if you don't want prostate cancer, coom. Uh, also, paradoxically, um, but it does actually make sense if you look at the chemicals that are involved. Uh, if you drink lightly, you are at a lower risk of liver cancer than somebody who does not drink at all. If you drink heavily, of course, you can have liver cirrhosis, which could also lead to transformed cells. But uh, drinking lightly, it's uh, it's simply because uh, uh, okay. Let, let, let me let me let me give you like a little bit of uh, stuff background. Uh, y you know, you can buy stuff which is uh, antioxidants, or it purports that it's an antioxidant, and uh, you consume it orally, and somehow somehow you get antioxidant effect. It, it does nothing. Uh, it can have an antioxidant effect inside the stomach. Yeah, true, a blueberry can do that, but it's going to be degraded. Most of the uh, antioxidants that you have are being manufactured inside your body. And the main, main one in, in that case is uh, GSH glutathione. And glutathione is just eternally recycled. If there is a uh, oxidative stress in a cell, glutathione can scavenge that, uh, those free radicals and then it can be recycled again and it becomes glutathione all over again. And for example, with consuming a light amount of alcohol for your liver, it, it creates a light level of oxidative stress in the liver tissues. But what happens is it tries to adapt to that so it creates exponentially more glutathione as a compensatory mechanism. And in that compensatory mechanism, you actually drop the overall inflammation level of that tissue which could be quite protective for uh, the case of transformed and precancerous cells. So, uh, for example, uh, yeah, uh, if that's the kind of stuff I can be uh, uh, talking shit about. <laughs> what made me learn this? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Um, 
I, I, I did I did generalized pharmaceutical research, but then I got uh, specifically into immunology. That that stuff has a lot of answers for uh, a lot of our modern cancer problems because you'll see people who are in uh, stage three and stage four cancers. Um, I I probably am gonna dox myself accidentally if I talk about uh, things in specifics, but. Uh, I, I have previously talked to some merchants, and I've also talked to uh, some friends about uh, actually seeing an immunology clinic rather than uh, going for methods which don't actually work or offer a long-term solution. Because they, I think traditionally we used to think that, hey, if you cut out the tissue, you're going to be fine. But if you miss a tiny little amount of a tissue... You're not going to be fine given a long enough period of time, but now you've got the reduced quality of life. Um, but uh, if if you're interested, I can't give you I can't give you specifics until I actually go through my folders and I uh, remove any mention of myself and clean that out. But uh, Germany, Austria, they've got some very good immunology clinics. They um, they're pretty solid, and I think if you if you do get to a a serious enough stage it is worth doing medical tourism to to get over there it's it's practically two weeks of therapy and we can actually have you clean after that <sighs> and yeah yeah I, I i can do like a full goddamn uh stream on, on on cancer talks and then we can just answer generalized questions and so on um in, 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 in general, though, I, I think the, the field is getting very, very good. <laughs> Sweden has a very good euthanasia clinic. <laughs> uh, also, if you have uh, one, of the, one of the biggest signs, if you, if you actually have transformed cells or a tumor, um, if you want to be looking for symptoms, I, I, I'd say if you get a sudden pain in any area of the body, but it is transient, it goes away after some time, uh, that's not a tumor. If you have a, a pain at, ra ra at uh, semi-regular intervals that persists, especially persisting for weeks in a localized area, yeah, you should probably uh, get some imaging done. Um. <clears throat> oh, if you're interested in that Amazonian game, it's the nation's gold. But but uh, but also yeah, uh, a, a lot of things that I found in my time in working with immunology is that uh, there was truly a a link between getting very good physical exercise, especially uh, particularly high impact exercise, and reducing your risk of uh, having any kind of transformed cells. I mean that's why you got people who are like uh, Arnold Schwarzenegger who are still going strong. Uh, all they have is uh, regular heart attacks from their steroid use. Can you recommend me a coom game of Amazons? Uh, I don't know, man. Honestly. Uh, I define high impact as uh, just getting, getting to that uh, oxidative threshold. You need to get to... Uh, it needs to be anaerobic. So you need to get to a point where um, you're actually shredding your muscles. Yeah, yeah, ask Jughead if you want a specific Amazonian game. <laughs> Man, I... Okay. In the meantime, what would you guys want? Would you like um, a Rise of Legends? Because I don't think enough people actually play that shit. Also, I have completely unsorted folders. You're the Godhead? Douchebags. Ha! Yeah! I wonder how many of these I'm actually allowed to show. <laughs> Sorry. This, this one is literally like me in a fucking nutshell, whatever anybody fucking asks me for money. Sorry, Link. I can't give credit. Come back when you're a little... Mm, richer. <laughs> <laughs> also, uh, since uh, Mandalore covered Brigador... Uh, the entire intention was to give him a bunch of money so he can actually fucking finish Brigador Killers. Uh, 
I do recommend you look up the Brigador Killers OST because that shit is actually sick. So, uh, yeah, you can probably look all that up. Makeup and Vanity Set, great artist. I will, I will do the David Cage name, uh, the David Cage game, because I, I, I specifically downloaded it for this situation. Um, uh, I guess, I guess not many people talk about fucking, uh, Rise of Legends. So there's Rise of Nations, and then somebody fucking decided, yo, what if we just did that shit with, um, uh, with, with shit that's actually fucking cool? Uh... Let me, let me show you some shit. Uh, I'm deep in the campaign. I don't know if I can even show off a goddamn campaign map. Uh, you got a story mode. So, uh, legit story mode in this game. Uh, story mode in this game works like uh, Dawn of War Dark Crusade or uh, Rome Total War. You actually, uh, y you can take different regions and other people will take different regions as well. This shit is a- uh, it's a very nice game. This is my fucking juggernaut. Look at that rusty piece of shit. <laughs> oh, and- and, uh... So essentially, the different factions are... You get these dudes, which I'm playing as. And in, in this universe, you, you got three kinds of people. You got people who do magic and shit, and they look like, um... Very overweight genies. Uh, you've got the people who are the Aztecs who found technology that fell from the sky. And then you've got the fucking Mecca Italians. That's the Vinci. Look at that shit. This is your main character. You know what his weapon is? Everybody gets like a fucking pussy ass weapon. But, uh... Th this guy straight up gets a goddamn grenade launcher. And he has about three pixels for his hands. I don't know if I've actually got good footage, but wait. I need, to, I need to show you how this actual campaign starts. You think your brother's toys will really work? Of course, Carlini. Giacomo's a genius. Not some useless military relic like you. Oh yeah, Besides, I, do, I do start my... Would you rather carry the driver. object home on your back? Yeah, I'll pass, thanks. But those miners who found it? Not a good way to die. I'd be happier if you stayed behind. Ha! You worry too much, old man. I'll be sure to carve that on your tombstone. What are you gonna do with that thing, anyway? I'd like to study it. I think I can do that safely, once we get it back to my lab. Study it. You find something that makes you sick when you get near it, I say bury it and leave it alone. Oh no, what could possibly happen? The device is nearly extracted, my doge. But the workers are suffering from- They don't know the meaning of suffering, Lieutenant! Keep them at it! Sir! Be on it, soldiers! Calm yourself, Lieutenant! I brought a gift for them. That's actually how it introduces also how fucking sick a clockwork man is. Giacomo, get out of here! Take my hand! No! Goodbye, Petruzzo. Once the dust settles, send in a few men. No one survives. Sir! No, not the Bruzo. I'll get you, Doge. You know, ketosis is fine, but uh, your brain can't run on ketones. <laughs> the Vernaza Expedition. Petruzzo, Lord of Miana, has led the party to investigate an unknown device uncovered by one of our mining operations. I had hoped to use this outing as a field trial for my latest clockwork man design. We were ambushed near the mine by Doge Alessandro Venucci, 
My brother was lost, but General Carlini and most of our soldiers survived the attack. I swear this, the Doge will pay for Petruzzo's mur- <laughs> Fuck. I swear this, the Doge will pay for Petruzzo's murder. My brother Petruzzo is dead. <laughs> Man, I need to make these lines fucking louder. I'm sorry. <laughs> look, look how fucking good they are at shooting. Manucci conscripts are no match for me. For Petruzzo, across the bridge. Uh, by the way, um, spoiler: Petruzzo is never mer mentioned ever again. But at the cost of my brother and a few of my men. Oh wait, Petruzzo was his brother. I completely forgot that part. Don't worry, it's Even never worse, mentioned again. The Doge escaped with whatever it was that was making those miners sick. <laughs> when I find that Venucci rat, I'll have my revenge. <laughs> As we crossed over into Padonia, we received more reports of, uh, of attacks. It quickly became clear that the raiders were not Vinci. Survivors of attacks describe creatures or perhaps machines made of glass. Yeah, okay. Also, my man sniping off a horse. <laughs> I can't believe he has accuracy on that shit. Oh, my man Giacomo sniping with a pistol. Oh, and for some reason, um, when you when you uh, repair Italians, they actually heal up, regardless of the fact whether they're made of flesh or uh, other components. Okay, this is what we came here for, so you can see high quality Italian animations. <laughs> Yeah, boy. <laughs> Italian Titanfall. <laughs> Look at this man, he's so happy with his goddamn mech. <laughs> this, is how, this is how flying technology could be. That terrain looked like Iraq. <laughs> That's practically all this game is. This one is literally... We're just going to be digging the earth for minerals. This is peak Italian technology. And, and of course, um, oh yeah, because Giacomo is a good guy. And you know how good guys are. Okay, wait, I'm just going to repair these people real quick. Gia Giacomo, because he is um, part of a good side, he has an ability. Um, he summons a uh, jihadi uh, clockwork men instead and of course because he's a heroic man he's willing to sacrifice a lot of troops <laughs> I think these guys won't even have enough time to get here like, this is this is literally the siege of Fallujah there's an oil pipeline here wait I think we have slaves yeah they're called miners but you know People who are miners usually don't have, like, a, a collar that they have to wear, which might detonate if they don't do their jobs. Ah, <sighs> muscle synthesis. Muscle building and protein synthesis. Honestly, uh, uh, no, nothing to say. Just, high, just eat complete proteins and uh, do high-impact exercise. That's it. As long as you break your muscles, there's going to be more ones that are going to grow up. Oh yeah, the next Forex game is going to be Endless Space 2. It's a, it's a fucking sick game. There's a lot to talk about. Um, the latest DLC sucks dick. I fucking hate the Academy. Uh, but the second last one was actually okay. The Umbral Choir are really nice. <laughs> and, okay, we got, we, got some, we got some terrible junk that we can actually play. Has anybody in chat ever heard about Fahrenheit Indigo Prophecy? Because I'm going to give you uh, a little bit of a background. Because I wanted to show this on stream ages ago. There's a man called... Yes, it's David Cage. This little French man. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I haven't actually played Stellaris. But uh, Endless Space 2 is basically just a lot more active uh, Stellaris. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, we're, we're, we're going to play that for everybody who hasn't actually... Uh, experienced it by the way david cage so here's the thing david cage is a feet man he's also an ellen page man that's why he like included ellen page in his games and like they they said like the feet were extremely well modeled in this game they're also extremely well modeled 
Uh, I also really love the fact that David Cage gives the tutorial. <laughs> We're gonna do the tutorial because it's fucking hilarious. Hi, my name is David love Cage. Love you, Dark Baby. I'm the writer and director of Fire <laughs> I just thought there's a few things you should know before you get started. Wait. I'd like you to meet my friend Bob. You'll be controlling him while you're learning. Let's begin with something simple. Move toward the mark on the floor. <laughs> oh, it's time to learn the controls again. Thanks, David. Come on, give it a try. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you, Cage. He also looks you at you also uncomfortably. You can look around you and see exactly what you want to see. <laughs> That's cool. Now that you know how to move about, use the cameras and interact with the environment, we can move on to more serious stuff. Fortnite has action sequences where your character's life will action be Action sequences. I'd better explain this to you before you find yourself on your own. Go to the rip stall. By the way, this game is a lot more fun to watch. This game is a lot more fucking uh, fun to watch because uh, the quick time events, they get crazy. By the way, we finished the game on easy. Uh, we failed that shit multiple fucking times. Okay. You see this shit? Oh, it doesn't actually When record. this symbol appears at the top of the screen, it means your character is gonna have to make a physical effort. You'll see. You'll be exhausted too. See? This shit? Do you hear me? Do you hear me having fucking fun? This is easy. This is on easy difficulty. Hey, not bad. Now for something a bit more difficult. You're gonna find yourself facing all kinds of dangers in Fahrenheit. You're gonna need a cool head and good reflexes if you want to survive. This is best shit's coming now. Works. Best shit's coming now. <laughs> <laughs> That's what can happen if you don't have good reflexes. Try again. <laughs> David Cage throws a fucking car at you. Wait, what, 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 wait, 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 what? Failed again. Have another try. I... 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 No! <laughs> Failed again. Have another try. <laughs> it starts from the beginning. This is why I said this game is much more fun to watch. David Cage is just trying to kill me. Now let's talk about your mental health. Your Fahrenheit, mental health. Actions modify. <laughs> My man Lucas Kane just trying to jack off. <laughs> When you've had enough bleach filler episodes, a man has enough. Listen, my man, I can only deal with so much etchy. Give me some fucking content. You can't just retcon 30 episodes I watched. Oh man, I, I, I got a little bit what? heated. What, what have I done? I hope the mall cop doesn't fight, figure this out. Yeah, yeah, this game starts off heated from Quit. the very beginning. I, I've, I've got to get out of here before somebody comes in here. <laughs> Nothing happened. Oh no. Come on, you're alright. You're alright, officer. You're alright, you're alright. Um, flush him down. Flush him down the toilet. Just anxious now. I, I don't even know what happened there. Um, yeah, looking good. Okay, use the... Ah, yeah, it seems nice. Oh, yeah, yeah. Let's just take a little brew, and, uh... Oh, no. I remember this is what fucked me up before. Oh, my God. Oh! Oh! No. No. That's quick. Quick. 
No, you can't do this to me now. You can't do this to me now. Please. Please. Please just respond to my command. Oh, maybe it's because... Maybe... Lucas, please. Lucas, please. I have to do this perfectly vertical. Please appreciate that I have to do this perfectly vertical. Okay, I, I'm, I'm lowering the DPI. I have lowered the DPI. Fat shit. Lucas? Lucas? Lucas. Duh. It's barred up. I can't get out this way. Lucas? neighborhood before the police get Nobody here. goes anywhere. A crime has just been committed. I'm going to have to ask you to stay calm and wait here for the police to arrive and check your IDs. I live too far away to walk. I have to find another way to get <laughs> Fuck you, home. Lucas! Mm, looks homeless. Poor guy. Out in this freezing cold. Lucas, what are you fucking doing? <laughs> okay, I think it's time to go. Part of me already knew that this time, something was different. <laughs> du bist der Boss, Herr Kla. Herr Kala. <laughs> the murderer got away. No! Any witnesses? <laughs> Wer der Mord? Do you have any idea on who might be the murderer? This is, this is police officers before they were uh, pressing on people's necks. I want to go to my man Tyler. My man Tyler doing the best he can. What do you say we call it a night? Come back at this thing tomorrow when I... Tyler! <laughs> we're not finished, Tyler. we still got some important stuff to see before we can go home. Mm -mm, my man Tyler. My man Tyler gonna get a coffee. Yeah! <laughs> My man Tyler's the best. I fucking love Tyler. Tyler, can you shut that thing off? We're on a murder site here. <laughs> hey, I just thought I'd chill the atmosphere a little. Okay, it's off. Tyler got anxiety from her being a bitch. I can't believe this, Ty I can't believe this, Carla. This night's gonna end with a fucking double murder. Do you see my swagger? This is my man. My man's gonna have dinner. <laughs> and this guy is dying proof that pissing can be bad for your health. <laughs> Yo, what's good point, Dexter? I'm gonna get a coffee. Fuck out of here. I'm gonna serve myself. But you know what? You could fuck up this sequence. <laughs> you see this shit? <laughs> oh, man, I just can't get a hold on it. Fuck. Fuck. So difficult. I, I, I can barely lift. I can, <laughs> just gotta undock it. Fuck. Maybe I'll go in when it's a bit colder. Yeah, get some of that coffee. No, <laughs> wait. I didn't mean to fuck that one up. Put your fingers. Close in the fingers. Lift the tray. Lift it gently to your hand. Come on, you can do it, Tyler. You give a big sippy, yeah. Mm-mm, is that some good shit? Carla, you should try some of this. Wait, 
I wonder if there's something else I could fuck up in this kitchen. Another one? Hell yeah. This is uh, Fahrenheit. Fahrenheit is a, is a fucking hilarious game. <laughs> oh yeah, the woman gets a close-up. Whoa, it's so difficult being a female. <laughs> it's just so spicy. I, I've, I've had an entire white bread today. It's a, li it's a little too much. Oh no. Yeah, boy. Can I actually just get a coffee real quick? Give me a sec. I'm just getting flat. Sorry, I, I got this. 6, 6 p.m. flat is my, my coffee time. Mm -mm, these colors don't run. <sighs> yeah, I'm, I'm down to tense. No, normally I have it with a bit of milk, but uh, mil milk uh, adds a lot of phlegm. This serves no purpose, but I love that you could do it. He came every Monday. He always ordered the same thing. <laughs> Tyler in the background. <laughs> Can you tell me anything about the customer who left just before they discovered the body? Hmm. Do you know if a victim was circumcised? Was Is that true? You bitch. Did you hear anything while John was in the toilets? Sound Did you of a struggle a or yelling? A log? No, I didn't notice anything. He was shitting. He was silent. Can you tell me what you saw? Calm during the meeting. <laughs> Tyler's like acting up. Just... You're the only one who can help us find the suspect. Get together, Kate. <laughs> My ship. The guy just ran off without paying. That was horrific. Wasn't a... Help us construct a likeness of the killer. <laughs> we construct a likeness yeah. is just Tyler. <laughs> I'll do whatever you think. If you if you look at Tyler, I think as 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 Carla. Y you know what I think? You know what I think is happening? I got a theory. I got a theory that Carla's actually fucking racist. Cause like, whenever she looks at Tyler, right? Always looks like he's looking back at her. Yet he's texting all the time. You turn into my man, Tyler. Your, your hands are empty. But he doesn't respect women. That's why he knows that they're full of shit. <laughs> wait, 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 what? <laughs> Who's, whose turn is it to play on the iPad? I got some new iOS store games. Just look at this man. He's so goddamn fly. Fuck out of here, boy. I don't have time for this bullshit. I gotta go to my disrespectful girlfriend. Hmm. That's some perfectly good fucking food right there. Hmm. That looks like a steak and a drawn-on potato. Also, that's some rank coffee, honestly. Steak and fries. Looks like he barely touched his food. Strange. Coffee's not on the bill. <laughs> then who ordered the coffee? Martin says this was the guy's table. <laughs> but now it's my. Wait, wait, wait! Sorry, I thought his arms were like reaching out at some point. <laughs> hmm. Time to take a dive. <laughs> Time to take a dump. <laughs> Tyler's always smiling. You know the interesting thing? He's always smiling when he's not around his girlfriend, who fucking talks to him nonstop. What the fuck you doing here, Carlos? I was trying to get some privacy. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> yeah, damn, I'm looking good. Damn, that man dead. I can help with the washing. Hmm. There might be some potato in there. Just what exactly are you doing, Tyler? I'm checking for clues. What do you think? I love my man, Tyler. I love my man, Tyler. See, I can't conduct a proper fucking investigation because this bitch on her fucking Blackberry. See, I found a clue, ho. I'll take care of it. Tyler? <laughs> what? This is a restroom, isn't it? No, this is a crime scene. It's cool, I'm done. Must be all that coffee I've been drinking to try and stay awake. I love my man Tyler. Ah, you made Carlos stressed! <laughs> Get fucked, bitch! Ah. 
I swear to God, if Carla complains one more fucking time. <laughs> yeah, I think there's clues over here. Can I be honest with you? You might think like I'm, I'm, I'm fucking this up. Like I, I'm, I, oh, Seth's just doing some random shit. He doesn't know what the fuck he's doing. Uh, this is actually the way you're meant to do it. Cause, uh, cause, um, there, there's a reason. I think, I think, if it gives me the option, doesn't give me the option. Ah, uh, maybe, maybe maybe only Carla can get that interaction. I mean, she doesn't even let me search through the garbage bit for goodies. The killer must have used it to clean up the mess. Maybe, Carla. Why maybe. Why would he risk getting caught to do that? Because he was an ethical killer, and he didn't mean to do it. We might be able to find the killer here. You ever consider a career in plumbing, Carla? You ever <laughs> consider a career in comedy, Tyler? Hey, everybody <laughs> says I'm a very funny guy. My man, Tyler. <laughs> Let's just confirm that he's dead. They appear to be knife wounds. Maybe, Carla. Maybe. You shouldn't jump to conclusions. You want to take a shit? Tyler, can you shut up for two minutes? <laughs> <laughs> My man, Tyler's amazing. Okay, wait, wait, wait. How many times is, is it necessary to get that shit actually working? I forgot. <sighs> wait, 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 wait. I swear to fucking God. Do, do you know, it's designed like this. It's literally designed like this. You might get it, you might not. You might get it, you might not. Fuck that shit. Okay, we're going outside. Where is the outside again? Shouldn't, shouldn't somebody actually be working in this diner right now? Sorry, that was a very stupid question. <laughs> He's still dead. <laughs> Carla, she's really something else. She's not always easy to get along with, but she's the best damn cop I know. Okay, what does Carla think of Tyler, though? Tyler's been my partner for almost a year. He grew up with the gangs in the Bronx before he decided to join the force. Sometimes he's unpredictable, but he's a good guy. <laughs> he's, he, he's like, yeah, Carla's pretty great. Uh, Carla's like, yeah, my man Tyler used to be a criminal. <laughs> hey, Carla, I'm gonna take a look outside, see if I can find anything. Bye, Carla. Finally, peace and fucking quiet. Now I'm gonna talk to this homeless man. Hell yeah. Oh yeah. My man doing alchemy out here. Tell me, man, are you a firebender? Yo. What do you want? I was wondering, you didn't happen to see anything unusual tonight, did you? Ah, oh, leave me alone. I got nothing to say. I don't talk to cops. <laughs> Right, thank you. You've been helpful. Oh fuck, would Carla Oh, was I meant to talk to him with Carla? Fuck! Oh man, that's all I needed. Door doesn't open from the outside. <laughs> My man Tyler locked out. Meanwhile. Wait, what happens? Is is Tyler gonna like what Yes. See? This is how you can actually teleport him back in. Tyler, I'm gonna take a look outside. Tyler says nothing, because Tyler is actually pleased, and he is relieved that he does not have to have this woman here. Oh yeah, women women can't use fire yet. Good evening, sir. 
Whoa! <laughs> hey, uh, babe. <laughs> what can I do for you? You know, uh, you really shouldn't be outside tonight. It's freezing cold. If you want, I could have them come and pick you up and... Oh, leave me alone! I'm just fine. I don't need nobody. Cold enough for you? Yeah, well, luckily I got this to keep me warm. <laughs> you want a little splash? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go try to get someplace warm. Take care of yourself. I, I think I think that was I, I I don't know, Carla. I'm gonna head back. I know where the murderer is. Carla, please. She won't let me catch the murderer. Damn it. And Carla almost died. Tyler's got the keys to the car. I better go find him. <laughs> Carla would disappear without a trace. If not for his one little insurance policy. Luckily for me, a woman is in the passenger seat, so we will not have an untimely death. This is a multi-choice game. If you get Carla to drive, you die. <laughs> <laughs> My man Luke is a fucking mess. I didn't kill anyone. <laughs> this is how people be living out there. I wasn't dreaming. It all really happened. Hmm. I'm gonna get ready and go to work. I'm gonna get ready and go to work. Oh yeah, if you take the painkillers and the booze, you just fucking die. Okay, let's go look at porn. Time for some gaming. My mail. My inbox. You have no new message. Fuck. Uh web. Damn, video games be dangerous. Cold weather. Pakistan. <laughs> the ultimatum delivered to the new Pakistani government ends today at, seven, at, at 5 o'clock yesterday in Islamabad. The new president announced to a crowd of more than 200,000 people that he has no intention of standing down. He again accused the American government of trying to acquire control of the oil fields recently discovered in the region of... Uh, Oh, please, can I scroll a little bit easier? Of Gilgit. Nope. Nope. We can't actually read this. Nope. We actually physically can't reach this. Anyhow, Islamic fundamentalists, yada yada. Another day in Pakistan. <laughs> I guess I'll never find out what happened in Pakistan. Maybe I should go to Islamabad. Maybe I need some fresh clothes. Hmm. Yesterday, at 7.30 p.m. Lucas, it's different. Yeah, yeah that, was, that was your ex. Yeah, you don't listen to your ex. Oh, man, I hope I don't get the fucking acid trip right now. Oh, no, 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 no. This is, this is not good for you, I don't think. No, 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 no. I think, actually, it can trigger at this point. Leave my, leave my, uh, Tiffany on silent. <laughs> oh, fuck's sake. Fuck's sake. I completely forget that it was like that. Fuck. <laughs> you, you know, I, I even knew that it was coming. You know, taking a shit actually helps with your depression greatly. <laughs> RDM Dr. Kleiner. <laughs> come on, Lucas, come on. We don't have... Fucking time. Uh, the sheets are full of blood. I can't go back to bed. I'm not tired anyway. I can't go back to bed. I didn't think that you should. Anyway, I, I need I need to take like a quick milk. Where's the bloody sheets? Where are the bloody sheets? Yeah, you're so reckless, Lucas. Get it together, man. 
Get it together, man. We got milk. Chill. We got milk. <laughs> you could just hold those fucking rags. <laughs> Hello, officer. Nothing is wrong. I did not stab a man. Wait. Lucas, turn on the washing machine, please. Oh, maybe I should wash my hands twice. Yeah, we're gonna get that boy some milk. Okay, quickly, quickly. Ah, oh, Lucas! You dummy! Good thing we don't have a corpse in there. Milk! Milk time. New York police, please open the door. The police, they know, they, they've come to arrest me. Police, open up. Just a minute, I'm coming. I'm coming. I can't let them find any evidence linking me to last night. I've got a couple seconds to hide everything before I get the door. Sir, this is the New York police. I must insist that you open this door immediately. Yeah, boy. Got some extra mental health. Let's see if there's anything else. Sir, I'll be with you right there. Right there, sir. Damn. If you do not open the door right now, I will be forced to knock it down. I... Oh, 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 officer, give me a second. Give me a second. I need to. Hmm. Wait one sec. Uh, officer, I'll be with you in a second. Oh, I can't play my music. I just need to enjoy the sunshine. This is your last warning. Open the door now, or I knock it down. Officer, fucking hell. My keys! Just a second, I'm looking for the keys! <sighs> I can't believe it, the timer doesn't even stop. Lucas, you dumbass! Quickly! Is this what police brutality feels like? I I'm sorry to make you wait like that. I, I was in the shower. Are you Lucas Kane? Yes. Mr. Kane, the neighbors heard yelling from your apartment. Is there a problem? Oh, yeah. Yeah, that was me. I cut myself on some broken glass and I freaked out a little. Fortunately, it wasn't a really big deal. Would it be all right if I took a little look around your apartment? Listen, I, I promise you, everything's fine. Uh, do you mind if I just go ahead and look around anyway, sir? I, I said yes! I think I said yes! <sighs> Whatever. Go ahead. I, I swear to God, I didn't click no! I didn't click no! I said yes, and he's like, yeah, 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 yeah. I told you, I had a stupid accident with some broken glass. Holy cow. When you cut yourself, you go all the way, don't you? Yeah, this guy doesn't have a warrant. I don't think you could actually do this. No, officer, don't go in there. That's there's my 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 eight my all cops are bastards shirt. Thank you for your cooperation. Uh, sorry to have bothered you, sir. You know how it is. With everything that's been going on, uh, we prefer to be careful. I understand. Long, Mr. Kane. Of course, officer. Now that milk. Yes. This is how life feels like. Uh, even if you've got the permissive search shit, they can basically save it like you didn't Massacre actually withdraw East it. Massacre End Restaurant. An especially horrible murder was committed last night in the restroom of a local restaurant. The killer is a man in his 30s of average height with brown hair. Police are already searching for the man and will be releasing a 
composite sketch in the next few days. Hmm, I wonder who that could be. Oh god, I swear to god if I got jump scared again. <clears throat> I'm gonna take another shit. Wait, wait, wait. Yeah, it's fine. I really hate how they like open doors here. This is like a classical jump scare opening doors. Okay. No, I can't even use it. Yes! Yes! I'm in no condition. My forearms still hurt. Lucas, you fucking pussy. After what happened last night, I'm not really in the mood to play the guitar. By the way, you, you later get to play the guitar. Don't worry about that. I hope that's not an alcohol. Yes. The body of a man was discovered in the restroom of an East End restaurant. The victim was stabbed several times with a steak knife. While just yards away, other customers were calmly eating their meals. Investigators are already on the trail of a suspect, who fled the scene just before the body was discovered. Police have no other comment for the time being, but stay tuned for updates into this. Oh no, we shouldn't have watched the TV. I, 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 I. The victim was stabbed several times with a statement. Stabbed several times with a statement. I'm so sorry for watching the TV, Lucas. Lucas. <laughs> Every time we're trying to watch Spongebob up in here. Uh... Wait, this is why... This is... <clears throat> when Marcus and I were kids, we were inseparable. He's the one who took care of... <laughs> Fuck, is this stunning. We kind of grew apart after he became a priest. But he's still the only person I really trust. The only one who might believe that I had nothing to do with all this mess. The priest camera. Hello, children. This was before Epstein. I, I literally think you can't do anything here. Is there any way to actually, like, gain some stuff? <laughs> oh, wow. That's your typical normie couple. Quickly, Lucas, stab on him. So tell me what's happened, Lucas. I've killed a man, Marcus. <laughs> if you cut your wrists? But that's a sin, Before Lucas. Before the murder, I, I carved these symbols on my arms with a knife. I don't know if they mean anything. Lucas, are you a Protestant? You saw a little girl? She seemed alone. Lucas, this is lost. quite typical. She, she asked me to help her. You know that I don't believe in all that. Thanks. <laughs> Literally, Catholicism gives you an extra, extra take. Oh, my man having another breakdown. Whoa, I'm a fucking dumbass. Damn, that was whack. Let's go home. Oh, oh, Lucas, Lucas, Lucas. There he is. He's lost consciousness. Quick, I've got to go back up before I run out of air. Uh, by the way, I am smacking A and D like, uh, like a fucking madman. This is gameplay. This is why it's better to watch this game being played than actually fucking playing it. Wait. Wait, wait, wait. Lucas, this is your chance. But when I left that park, I knew I could look myself in the mirror again without cringing. 
I've got this really bad habit for a cop. Where's that coffee machine? I'm not even allowed to run right now. <laughs> Carla, quickly. Carla, gently push the button. Yes. Get the fuck away from me, kiddo. Nobody here. Nobody here. Hello, Inspector. Oh, if a woman doesn't say hi, how typical. How typical, because there's no camaraderie amongst women, huh? Tyler is still not here. Tyler is not on beck and call. Nobody here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. You see this boy? This nerd? He actually owes Tyler money. I mean, I mean Tyler owes him money, of course. But, hey, uh, Carla. Can you tell your partner to pay me back that hundred bucks he owes me? You get the fuck out of here, Jeffrey, you stupid cook. You know what happens? Tyler's not paying back that money anyway. And Tyler makes more money back hey, from him. I identify strongly with Tyler. <laughs> Look at these computers. Look at that shit. Fucking Alienware right there. Tyler still hasn't gotten rid of this basketball. Funny, I thought I'd been pretty clear. Why is that man not done exactly as I say? Again! Call that man's ass up. Oh no, I think I didn't play with my yo-yo. That's a boy. Yeah? You know, know what time it is? Oh shit. <laughs> Tyler goes back to bed. <laughs> oh, this is a hard. Idiotic, but it helps me think. Oh my god. Fuck, Carla. <laughs> Depressed. This is, this is a quick time events you came here for. What the fuck? I can't believe this. And then, and then Carla like keeps talking shit to Tyler. It's like, why are you not at work? Why are you not at work? I'm hard. I'm hard at work here yo-yoing. Quickly, Tyler. Oh! Fuck yes. Come on! Fuck ya! Yeah. Ah. Did, did I get any stress points for that? I better. Yes. Yes. Now we can spit on Tyler's basketball and go back to work. How many keys are on that fucking keyboard? Now we gotta go to my man Tyler. I think there's nothing else in this room. <laughs> That's it. That's the end of the game. Tyler never wakes up. Wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. Wait. Hmm. He's considering it. M maybe. M maybe. And stay a little longer. Mm, sorry, babe, but I really gotta go. I'll make some coffee. Okay, I'll grab a shower, get dressed, and then I'm out of here. <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, baby. I need to. I need to do every kind of thing here that is not my work. Hey, 
You're a good looking guy, you know that? Hell yeah, Tyler. That's my boy. Now it's time to drop a fat load. I'm gonna tell you why I call this for cleansing. Unleash for Python. This woman's eyes are just so dead. Like, like I, I swear, her eyes are so fucking dead. I give you all the luxuries of a modern world. We even have a working fridge. Wait. Fuck! No milk. Why couldn't we just go to Florida and work with my family and live a normal life like everybody else? We're gonna go to Florida and well, die, Sam! To... Can you see me selling shoes from behind a counter Fuck. while kids Fuck. are like killing each other in the streets? I belong here where I can do some good, not in Florida. Man, fuck Florida. Fuck out of here. Nice coffee, Sam. Fuck out of here. I'm gonna hold the fridge door open. Oh, she giving me that fucking look. You know what that look is? That look is I don't have any choice. So I'm gonna go with it anyway. I love you, Tyler. I love me too, Sam. <laughs> Tyler music! How to do there, generic white man. This is, this is what like the average person at an Olive Garden looks like. I'll play you a game of b-ball for your hundred bucks. If you win, I'll give you two hundred bucks right then. But if you lose, we cool. Jeffrey never getting fucking paid. Go fuck yourself, Jeffrey. Yes. Damn. A David Cage experience. Detroit killed Jeffrey. Yeah, there's no quick time event for basketball. C Cage already knew that like uh, the audience playing this would not have the skills. Yeah, 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 I know. The yo-yo is something that white people can do. Penis and larger. Life sentences for 200 peer-to-peer -peer pirates. Illegally downloading music files from a peer-to-peer -peer site. China preoccupied by situation in Pakistan. The Chinese leader, Xi Jinping, has announced that he is extremely preoccupied by the current situation in Pakistan. He added that the Pakistanis had elected their new president democratically, and no foreign power had the right to question their choice. He also said, China would respond to an American intervention in any of China's neighboring countries. An unofficial source has reported the mobilization of 500,000 Chinese bots <laughs> at the Sino-Pakistani border. So basically, uh, 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 stream was about to be two hours, uh, but uh, we, we kind of went overboard a little bit because of uh, Fahrenheit. But we're gonna have like more Fahrenheit and some other shit uh, next time because uh, you guys have been great for it. Why can't... Why? <laughs> what? It actually did not let me do fucking... Yeah, boy. Espanol next stream. <laughs> Could literally never fucking change the goddamn subtitles. Yeah. Anyhow. Thank you for everything. Cheers uh, for, for everything. I'm gonna redistribute the funds because apparently I can do that now. Yeah, it's just that my German is fucking bad. Because I, I, I'm gonna go for the thing that I'm actually looking for, but then I'm just gonna pick something wrong. Yeah, it has been redistributed. Uh, thank you for everything. Uh, it's uh, it's gonna be same time next time. Maybe we start a little bit earlier, uh, but we still do around the two hours. It's been it's been a, a whole bunch of fun. <laughs> Should have paid more attention to Auschwitz, Seth. I always tell people as a joke, it's like, you know, maybe a lot of us passed away during the time of troubles. On the other hand, DiGiorno pizzas would not be so developed. Oven technology would be not so advanced. You know, they talk about uh, Dr. Mengele. You know who they don't talk about? They don't talk about fucking Dr. Utker. Where do you think Dr. Utker started from? That's right. 
Fucking Auschwitz. Dr. Utker was the right hand man of Dr. Mengele, and that's how he learned how to make his Quattro Formaggio pizzas. And that's a fact. Uh, <laughs> no, 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 I, not, not like that earlier. I'm just saying, like, maybe like 30 minutes before. <sighs> <laughs> Anyhow, you boys take care and uh, stay safe. And uh, yeah, stay cool. Don't die on me. Mwah.